Hey, what's going on? Thank you so much for joining me in this video of Crushing E-Commerce. My name is Travis Patel, and in this section, I'm going to talk about setting up your custom audience and your, uh, your conversion pixel settings so that you can properly have all the features and settings we need with our Facebook advertising. First off, we have the custom audience set up. What we need to do is we need to set up the right pixel code, the right script from Facebook, add it to our Shopify store so that Facebook can track and see exactly what viewers are visiting our store. From here, when we add this custom audience retargeting code in there, we can start creating custom audiences for everyone who visits single uh, sales pages of ours and be able to uh, promote advertisement to them, retarget them over and over again, and get them back in our store. So we need to have that pixel code set up before it's possible. We also have to do that with the conversion pixel. Conversion pixels is something Facebook offers to allow us to see exactly who's purchasing. It allows Facebook to optimize for that data, and it allows us to really expand on our advertising options once you have winning campaigns. So we want to set up a conversion pixel here as well. So first off, let's go ahead and set up that conversion pixel. You're gonna go into your Facebook ad account and in the conversion tracking area on the left, we can go ahead and create a new pixel. Now we're gonna have it for checkout. So you have all these other options. We're gonna choose checkout. So we're gonna call it our, our store name. So Don Mazuma will be our first pixel there. Create this pixel. And we're gonna grab the script coding that pops up. View pixel code. We can copy this. And then we're going to head into our store, into the settings area, into the checking setting, checkout settings like we talked about before. Now if you scroll down into the there we go, additional content and scripts area, this is where you want to add this conversion pixel because it's on the checkout page. So on the thank you page, when someone purchases, they've paid money, then this is where the code is. That person visits the page, this pixel fires, Facebook knows that they converted, we know it converted, we can see exactly who that audience member was. So conversion pixel is very important to have in place there, and that's all it took right there to add it in. Now we're gonna click Save. Now the next thing we need to do is set up a custom audience pixel. So we need to have that script in place so that we, like I said, Facebook will be able to track how many people actually just visit the sales page. So we're gonna go in and we're gonna create a new custom audience, website traffic, really doesn't matter what you have here at all. We're not using this as an actual custom audience, we just need the script and the code to put into the back end. So we'll click OK, here's our Don Mazuma custom audience, view pixel, this gives us the code here we can copy. Now this one's a little bit trickier and it's gonna depend on your theme but for this one, we're gonna go into the theme editor, so the online store, themes, and for our customize, we're gonna go in this three dot area and edit HTML, CSS. This gets us into the actual coding of the site. Now, typically what we're gonna do is we need, to head, we need to add this retargeting script into the header, so before this head tag closes, right here is the close, we need to add this retargeting pixel script right here. So this is it, just paste it right in. And that should be us. Go ahead and click save. And now we have our retargeting pixel set up. Every time we have a new sales page, um, we can create a custom audience for that single sales page and this code right here allows that to be tracked. So, hope you guys got a lot from this video. You need these pieces in place properly to be able to do all the great advertising things we have and all the long-term assets that we're able to build. So definitely get those in play before moving on to actually having the advertisement rocking out. So once again guys, Travis Patel here. I will talk to you soon.